Hello friends and welcome to Global Defense. In today's episode, we are going to talk about the history of F-35 Lightning II stealth fighter jet and how this most advanced 5th generation stealth combat aircraft is still making the history. So it is the most advanced aircraft right now which is operational in the multiple air forces around the world. But this aircraft has cost a lot. For example, the lifetime cost of uh, this aircraft is about 1.7 trillion and it took years in the making. The F-35 Lightning II is a big investment for the United States military so as well as its allies. So this program has achieved number of milestones recently. For example, on January this year, the F-35 Joint Strike Fighter Jet program basically achieved the number of milestones. For example, 990 aircraft of all these three versions have been delivered to different air forces around the world. The operational fleet has logged over 773,000 hours of flight and about 469,000 training and operational sorties. In terms of training, almost 2,300 pilots have qualified to fly this stealth aircraft and around 15,500 maintainers have qualified to service and support the, this aircraft. So this aircraft is basically composed uh, of uh, multiple expertise from the different countries. So this program basically comprised of 17 countries including the Italy, Canada, Australia, Denmark, Norway, Israel, Japan, South Korea, Belgium, Poland, Singapore, Finland, Switzerland, Germany and the Netherlands, the United Kingdom and the United States as well. Though there are other countries, for example, the Czech Republic and Greece, which are still waiting to join the development of this aircraft. So out of these current participants, 14 services are flying the aircraft while 12 have declared initial operating capabilities and there are 8 operational missions by the services. So far the 17 participants have ordered around 3500 aircrafts of all the three version. The F-35A is the most popular one and 2,558 orders followed by the F-35B version with 575 orders and by the F-35C version with 340 orders. As far as the largest individual customers, the US military alone has ordered almost 2,500 F-35s for the Air Force, Navy and the Marine Corps. As for the F-35B version and F-35C version of this 5th generation aircraft can basically operate from the aircraft carrier as well as from the other warships in the US Navy. So Royal Navy and Italian Navy have been activated to support the advanced aircraft. Nine additional warships are slotted to qualify for F-35 operation by 2028. So F-35-2 is a 5th generation multi-role aircraft that can conduct several different missions as well. So there are basically three versions. The first one is F-35A, the F-35B which can take uh, basically take the short takeoffs and vertical landing that can take off and land like a helicopter. And then you have got the F-35C that is the aircraft carrier version of the stealth fighter jet. So in terms of missions, the F-35 Lightning II can basically compete uh, dominantly in the air superiority as well as close air support it can provide. It can perform strategic attacks as well as electronic warfare. Beside that, intelligence surveillance and reconnaissance and suppression of the enemy air defenses. And also it has the capability to destroy the enemy air defenses as well. Beside that, the destruction of the enemy air defenses. So, other than stealth capabilities and performance and advanced weaponry, it is the F-35 sensors that are making it the most valuable air aircraft in the world. Its elec active electronically scanned array radar and other sensors basically help F-35 Lightning to act as a quarterback. It can basically guide the friendly aircraft, the warships, the smart munitions and the ground troops to a threat with a precision so basically this aircraft is continuing to make history as it will stay in the service for the next 30 to 35 years so friends this was about the history and the current operational performance of the f-35 fighter jet this fighter jet continue to get the block update and the newer version are equipped with the latest softwares as well 
So friends, this was about today's podcast. I hope you liked today's podcast. Do inform us about your valuable opinion in the comment box. And thank you for listening.